What's up YouTube, it's Axel here with the first ever video on the channel. Today I'm going to show you a few easy tips on how you can speed up the process of getting Obsidian on the Car 98K. Also, if you would like me to make more tutorial tutorials on how to get Obsidian or other camos inside Modern Warfare, just let me know in the comments below. So if you guys could please drop a like, subscribe, and don't forget to turn on post notifications so that you don't miss a single video. And without any further ado, hope you guys enjoy the video. Alright, so as you can see, I already have the Obsidian Camel unlocked for the Car 98K. But before we get started, I just want to let you guys know that as hard as it, as it is to accept it, it is not a one day thing, so it will take a little bit of hard work and dedication. But it will be worth it in the end, don't worry guys. Which leads me into my first tip, which is time. To get this camo as fast as possible, you need to set a time goal. Like for example, you need to ask yourself, by when do I want this, this um, camo to be, or this goal to be achieved? Like, if you started the challenge on a Monday, then challenge yourself to complete it by, or even before, the end of the week on a Sunday. For me, it took about seven days because of my crowded schedule involving school and other normal life things, but um, for you, for you guys, it should take like way less time as long as you have, um, if you don't have a busy schedule like me. For my second tip, it is choosing the right game modes. What I mean by choosing the right game modes, I mean choosing a game mode that you feel comfortable playing in while using a specific gun, like in this case, the Car 98K. I personally recommend playing hardcore matches like Shoot House and Shipment. Um, the reason I recommend playing hardcore is because it makes getting almost every kill camo in the game easy due to kills only being one shot instead of having to stress while missing shots for a single kill, you know? Literally, the only downside uh, are having your HUD removed and um, you will also be able to get one-shotted by enemy players. Oh yeah, and I highly recommend using Shipment because of its small size, enabling you to move around quicker, allowing you to get kills even quicker as well. For tip number three, you should monitor your kills per game. So I don't know if you guys already knew this or not, but after completing the 15 kill requirement in a match, you can just leave that match after doing so and it will still count towards the challenge. I personally think that this is the most effective tip that I can give you out of all the other ones that I already said in this video because of how much faster you can complete the 15 kill requirement per match instead of having to wait for the current match to finish, load back into the lobby and then wait for the game to look for your next match which can get pretty annoying considering that you have to repeat this process 125 times in order to get the camo. For the next tip, tip number 4, only use the weapon you're trying to get the camo for. So basically what I'm trying to say here is that you should only use the gun that you want obsidian for as a priority, meaning that you should only use that specific gun. In this case, it would be the Car 98K. Trust me, this tip can be very helpful because it aims mainly towards beginners. Because the more you practice improving your accuracy with the gun you want, Obsidian on, <laughs> sorry, you won't struggle as much while trying to complete the Obsidian challenge for your weapon of choice. And for the fifth and final tip that I have for you guys, keep your eyes on the prize. Okay, so I know you guys already know this, but please don't give up no matter what. Because as long as your mind is set towards achieving this goal of unlocking Obsidian, then 
you will feel great about yourself once it does happen. Trust me, like, once I got my Obsidian Camo, I felt, I didn't even know what to feel, actually. Like, I felt so excited getting the, the Camo. I was like, bro, this legit took me so long to get. I worked so hard towards it. Like, I actually felt a great sense of accomplishment. And I'm sure you guys will feel the same once you guys get yours. Alright guys, to wrap up the video, these were my 5 tips on how to get Obsidian on the Car 98K in Modern Warfare fast. And if you haven't already, make sure you guys drop a like if you did enjoy the video, as well as subscribe if you're brand new to the channel, and turn post notifications on so that you don't miss any of my future videos. See you guys in the next one. Peace.